Previously on Ghost 1.0. Bugen. Ghost is a damn Naka. Shadow, sneak into Nakamura's space station and find that intruder. I want to know who it is and who they work for. I see there's only one way to convince you, so I'll do it. What are you gonna do? Give you the ultimate evidence. Discover Ghost's IP. And now the outcome. Hello everyone! Welcome back to some more Let's Play Ghost and... Uh, Ghost! 1.0! <laughs> I was, uh... I was about to say Ghost in the Shell. Oh man, actually, now that I think about it, that would be a good movie to watch, considering how much of this I've been playing recently. I haven't watched Ghost in the Shell since... Wow, since I've been in college. That was a fantastic anime. You know, I wonder if they... Did they ever make, like, a second one of them, I wonder? Or a series? That was a... It was a... That was... That was a fantastic anime again. I, I, I know I, I already said it. Hold on, everyone. Hello. So I'm, I'm looking at these trying to figure out what it is I need to do. Wow. That looks really bad. Down there. We don't want to hit that. Alright, let's wait for these things to be get repaired. No, I don't think so. Alright, here we go. We're going to the first. I think I found a way. Shoot. The chunker wastes a large amount of energy. If we create a fault in the chunker's differentials, the power in the whole section will go down. You want us to try... jump-starting? Yes, but only in the chunker. Right when the electrical system goes down, the rest of the space station will notice a slight displacement in its potential difference. The disturbance in the force! Yes. This will cause communications up there to be altered for a few milliseconds. It's very little time, but we can definitely register it. Let's do it. How do we proceed? Easy. We have to find the main power conductors and overcharge them simultaneously. Wait, wait, wait. We don't have a map of Nakamura. How are we supposed to find those conductors? And how do we overcharge them? Well, we can find them using a power scanner, and we can overcharge them by using electromagnetic bombs and a remote detonator. Power scanner. Electromagnetic bombs. Remote detonator. Aren't you asking for too much? We can't waste time looking for devices that may not exist up there. Dude, they have 3D printers. And I have blueprints. Oh, oh! Boogan, you're a genius! Ghost, go to the nearest 3D printer. What for? Just go! Okay. So, I mean, we've got the room we just came from. I guess we'll go back up to the room we just came from. Oh, careful, Tim. Ooh, that was close, that one. Holy crap! So what... What purpose does this room serve? Like, this is... Oh, this is junk! But they're not teleporting junk up here from the planet. Maybe these are the remains of other Nakas or other experiments they've done. Houston, I'm at a 3D printer. Hold on. We're printing some stuff for you. Houston, I have the devices. What am I doing with these? Ghost, Boogan here. Find the main power conductors in the chunker, then place an electromagnetic device on each of them. Some of them might be in the wall, so be sure to use the scanner. Acknowledged. Okay, so then we have to sacrifice one of our spots for this thing. Where's this device? That's not it. Detects hidden energy currents at short range. Alright, where is it? That's the unknown device. That's electromagnet. Those are my healing items. Wait, I'm getting really confused. We just... Was it a, one of these things we picked up? Oh, speaking of which, we should reactivate all my other things here. 
What did we just- I thought we just picked it up. Did we not pick it up? It looked like a consumable. Is it not a consumable? Slight shut down on critical shut down wave force field bank shot regeneration. I don't even see it. Do you guys see it? That's a hologram which I really should be using for boss fights. I don't know where this thing is. Use the scanner. Is it a weapon? No. It's not one of these. I'm getting really confused. I don't see it. Oh, there it is. I do see it. I do see it. Holy crap. That was really confusing. Here it is. Alright, so we want that. We'll put it there. Oh god, wrong button, Tim. You're not, <laughs> you're not playing... Uh, whatchamacallit. You are not playing in Dark Souls. There is no reason to do that. Do I, do I blow it up? How do I how do I blow it up? Do I shoot it? Alright, hold on. Here we go. Let's do this. Oh, is there a detonator I also have? I didn't see another thing in here. So we've got that. Oh, we, we're just placing the bombs. The detonators will be used by, I guess, jackers and Putin. Oh, I used to be scanning, Tim. Oh, crap! That was not at all what I wanted to do. Tim, you hit the wrong button. I don't even know what these things are, are here. Oh, there we go. We blow up the track ourselves. That we would actually have something. Right, we should check all these rooms. Can we go up here? I wonder if it's just within this zone, or if these bombs are located everywhere throughout the facility. And darn it, we're gonna have to. Back. Oop, one button. Tim, you're gonna die! <laughs> I keep hitting the button to jump as if it was playing Dark Souls. I'm not playing Dark Souls, Tim. These things don't have anything in them. I wanna go down there, though. So, this is the chunker. So, I guess this is taking the scrap and bringing it down into component parts. Maybe we do ship garbage up here, and then we convert it into robot parts. Or other other materials. This room is way too quiet for it there not to be a to be a thing here. Oh, but there isn't. Okay. Nothing in this room. That's really weird. What the heck? Maybe we could have possessed that one robot? Any secrets around? No. Alright, well, let's move on then. Oh, hello. I want that. There either. All right, let's grab this stuff, and then I can think about something to talk about. I'm sorry, I'm, I'm so focused on what's happening, and why didn't this give me a secret? Hold on, I'm confused. Where's the thing I'm missing? Oh, hello. Wow, I... This is the first time I've ever seen this. I mean, that's obvious, but... What, what I mean is that I'd never thought there'd be multiple segments to a single room like this before. Oh, wow. Oh, oh. Yes, of course. 
Generation 10, so that gives us one of these. Go, go, go! Nothing in the area. Yeah, so Ghost of the Shell. Ghost of the Shell was about... What if... It was about... How to describe it? The best thing I can... I can do to describe it is... Well, I guess talk about it. <laughs> Tim. <laughs> the movie was about... Perhaps what it meant to be human. There was a... It was the future. It's an anime. It was a police district. And some of the members of the police force were augmented. One in particular, I forget her name, she was almost, uh, she was entirely, basically, cybernetic? It would be the equivalent of Ghost here. She was a, ro a robot, basically. She had a completely manufactured shell. But her brain was still human. I think, or it might have just, she might have had a, uh, just a chip inserted, but I, I think her brain was human, but I'm not, I'm not entirely sure. In either case, it, it was about what it meant to be human, and she was curious if she had a soul, of course, of the sort. It was a very well put together anime, and I really liked that the art was amazing for it too, especially at the time. Right, what am I looking for? I could use that. Where's the propulsors? Well, no, 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 we're falling into a crusher. Oh, wow! I think we'll grab this. Because maybe I don't even have to have that equipped. And it will automatically save me. Let's actually put it out here. Hopefully don't forget to use it. And then we're going to grab one of these 160s. That's fine with me. And then we don't have enough cubes for any of the other purchases. It was that that movie really asked a bunch of posing, posing questions. Really got you thinking about what it meant to be human. Oh wow, this is gonna be tough, Tim. The sad part is I need to keep scanning at every single location for where these things could possibly be. They could be in walls. I'm assuming they're gonna be just not on walls. We might as well save the game, you purchased two things. I'm so surprised with how obsessed Jacker and Boogan are. At knowing whether or not Ghost is a robot or not. I, I don't see how it matters if she's getting the job done. I already got the secret thing from this. Let's try what's in this door. Can I possess this thing? No. Oh, of course, we have to... No, because it didn't show up in the scanner when we were here last time. Placed a bomb there, and I don't see anything. Wait, we can keep moving? How? Where? I don't see it. 
Oh, because that was an inner room, Tim. Oh, across this direction. I haven't done stuff like this since, like, Double Dragon. Okay, oh, that's good, though. We don't take too much damage from these. Oh, hello. It would be safest if we... my shell. So different people in the anime were augmented in different ways. And it was brought up that uh, some people were, were chosen, I think, because they were mostly human, so they think differently than people who were mostly augmented. Probably should check down here, too. Going this way. I don't know why, but I want to use this robot here. Let's see. Probably one over there. Yep. I like the music to this area too. Sorry, I'm, I'm so distracted by the game at the moment that I'm not thinking about... ...about what I'm talking about, in fact. Oh, oh my god! Oh my god! for a key. Okay. Now what are we taking... I haven't even looked at our new skills yet, so let's see what we have. AI makes your robot shoot enemies when not being controlled for 10 seconds. Jetpack. Allows you to fall slowly to reach far places when jumping. Emergency kit. Cloaks for 5 seconds. Creates a destructive wave and repairs 100 hit points just before dying. Has only one charge. Energy potential. Energy cubes have a higher value if you get to them fast enough. Picking up energy cubes cures 1 hit point. Using any item heals you for 20 hit points. I like energy potential. So we got here, Energon Overload. Every three seconds, Jacker attempts to overload a robots with so much energy that they explode into energy cubes. Only works during alarm phases. Every four seconds, Jacker attempts to hack a protection module to emit poison within the shield of a protected enemy. 
We are Legion. Sometimes Jacker manages to call down a cluster of allied robots. Only works during alarm phases. That sounds pretty freaking cool. Abuse the force. Controlled robots cause 100% extra damage. Robots destroyed while possessed drop 20% more cubes. When in ghost form, you can detect hidden soul activation points when close enough. I'm going to pick soul detection. So now, I'm curious as to what that will look like. Let's drop down here. I really should deactivate them all. So one more time. This, 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 that. Yep, that should do it. This looks familiar to me. Have I done this one before? I don't think I have. Although, really, oh, wait, what? Why is this a blue question mark? Locked 3D printer. I'm possessing them just to see. I'm able to get the what I call to happen. Uh, to get one of the secret stuff to show up. I'm just wasting all that energy on. This is all done. Let's go back. So do I even want to be here? No, let's go back and take the rest of this. Let's see what's on the other side. Kill a robot, throw into the chunk of crow. Oh, nice. Holy crap. I guess I had that. Oh, that happened off screen. All right, so where are we going? Can't go that way. I came from upstairs. Let's try going down some more. Keep waiting for more of those spider bots to show up. Oh, all right. We're not going that way. All right, then. So... I guess we'll go back the way we just came, and now I can, uh, we'll wait to activate all my stuff until we're in that area. So I guess you would care if what you're talking to is a robot or not, if AI becomes advanced enough, right? Would you care? I don't know. I mean, you'd probably have to know, because if... Well, I, I, I guess if you're... like, Let's assume that you're friends with the, with the robot, or... Wow, I, you know, I never even thought about this. Do robots and humans have relationships? I don't know. If, if it's human enough, then... It would... I suppose someone... Like, if AI gets to the point where it's indistinguishable from human thought then it would have characteristics you might find charming or attractive. And I guess... I guess if someone had a relationship with the robot, they'd need to know, right? The rope Because if... If, she, if it was damaged, then you had to know to take it to the mechanic. Or whatever was doing the repairs for the robot. I never even even considered something like that. I suppose someone would make laws so that the robots wouldn't look like people. 
not reveal the stick. But that's not a realistic thing to expect either, I suppose, because someone somewhere would want it to happen. We probably should explore all of this area. Sure, you wouldn't be able to have like a you wouldn't be able to have children with a robot, right? Well, unless we come up with like an artificial womb. Oh man, holy crap, there's so many freaking questions that that would bring up. I I have no idea what I even think about this. Like I, I honestly don't. What is I will we ever reach that that potential? I I don't know. Oh, it seems so to me. And of course, that would be for, for human life, right? The robot wouldn't wouldn't be wouldn't have children that way, would it? I don't think it would. What if it wanted children of its own? You'd have to create another one rather than produce them that you know through normal quote quote means. Shot Enhancer, we'll probably want that. Upgrade Weapon, and a bunch of other guns that I'm not interested in. I'm sure they're awesome, but I don't have any more rooms, room, and I've spent way too much money on my current weapons. God, we need a lot of Energon if we want to upgrade our weapons again. Yeah, the music reminds me of like a Mega Man game. In this area. I, I suppose it is, right? I mean, it's a platformer with guns and robots. Let's go back to the, the thinking about what. Oh, one second. Let's put this here first. Oh, wow. This is gonna be bad. No! Holy crap, Tim! We're dying. Get out of here. What is over there killing me? Nothing. We killed it already. Forty percent. Another skill tree. What does this do? Controlled robots gain self-destruct as an extra secondary weapon. Enemies are printed using less material, lowering hit points by 20%. Repair kits, weapon rechargers disappear after 3 seconds. Oh man. Yeah, everything over here makes the game significantly tougher if you really want to. And you get an achievement by taking these immediately when they become available. But I'm not taking them. <laughs> not for my first playthrough anyway. Alright, so... Why don't we take healing cubes? Picking up energy cubes restores 1 hit point. It'll add up over time. And this must open up the other side we were at earlier. Yep. All right. Well, we're gonna oh, search this first for any more bombs. And I can, I can imagine to be all sorts of like humans first, human only groups, and so on, and people fighting for the rights of robots to have families and what have you. Oh man. Man. Like, I, robots would probably be able to outperform humans in several, well, obviously dozens of tasks as well. Like, information? For robots able to s store it, tons of information, then it would also be able to look it up really quick. Like, it would instinct, it would know all the answers how to solve certain problems. Uh, 
I'm beginning to think about what it would be like in the competitive workforce. Maybe we would reach a point where that wouldn't be a concern. Like, if we're able to produce such AI, then maybe we no longer have certain concerns or worries here anymore. Like, maybe we don't, maybe we no longer are working for money. Maybe, maybe we as a society have decided that we can do other things, or maybe there's no more, resources aren't as scarce anymore, so like, there's not as much competition for them. I need that one intact. Okay, let's go and get him. I'm gonna possess each robot just to see if any of them trigger special. I haven't seen any of these secret triggers yet. So maybe there aren't in every single room. Hello. Hello, robots. There's something up here. Oh, actually, there might be a bomb up here. Nope. Yeah, so I guess we can't put bombs in places like this. You know, I'm so busy looking around as well that I'm probably never going to notice one of the secret detection spots. <laughs> All right, where are we going, Tim? Forward and down. Yeah, I don't even know what, why we're in this area. Oh, well, obviously, I guess we're getting the yellow key card so that we can access other areas for the gold key card. Now, what happened in this place? I don't know if it means the room will have it in it. This is, this is another one of these rooms I don't understand what it does. There's no... Alright, we came from upstairs. Doesn't look like there's anything over there. I'm not gonna die for that energon. Oh god! Oh my god! Wow, that was terrifying, and I am so glad I picked up that thing. Because now it's out of charges. Man, if AI becomes... So, I'm still kind of linked between AI and something that looks like a human. Like Ghost here, is what I'm expecting. But the AI could be put in anything. You could have your car effectively be a human if we get AI that's that advanced. That's just crazy! We have Kit from Knight Rider. Let's bring this guy over here. Let's see what's on the other side of this. This is reminding me of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Oops. That was an accident. 
Well, while we're here, we must see what else is in this area. Do I have to be in ghost form to have this happen? One second, everyone. Yes! Okay. Alright, that's why. So, I would need to be in ghost form. And it says, when close enough. So this means we probably want to scan everything in the room. I don't know what I'd be looking for, but I don't see anything in this room that's setting it off. Ghost form once. Let me just go around really quick. Just see if I actually pick up one of these detection points. Oh man, I don't know if we're ready to have ev anything and everything become a human. Like, how will ever be. Oh god! Alright, we need to recharge our, our items, so we'll go back over here. I like the old animation better. I like the old animation better. Alright, so... Let's grab some of this, run this way... Wait. No, it was the other, other way. I think there's an item recharger down here. We haven't used too many of them, so I think this will be cheap enough that our 700 starting Energon pay for the re Actually, while we're here, we might as well just grab a bunch of stuff. And now we have more Energon, I think, than I had when I died. It's all good. It's all good. And that is so useful. Are we going, Tim? We're going back. Wait, no, we can just go this way. Uh, my concern is that... Oh, I guess we'd have to program them to be content and not bored. Like, if we put an AI that's a human in a toaster, like a literal toaster, not that we would do it, but if if we did it, can you imagine how boring that would be as a toaster? I mean, I'm, I'm naturally thinking something like me would be the, the AI. There'd probably be laws or something about putting AI into certain things. You'd have to... If we develop an artificial intelligence that's smart enough to recognize life and death and something like that, it'd probably be inhumane to do something like that to it, assuming that it even functioned the same way. Wait, what the heck am I doing? I want to teleport. I didn't go there to save the game. I went there to teleport. And I probably will end up off-screening some Energon farming to purchase more upgrades. For these guns of mine. All right, so we want to teleport. Want to teleport? I guess back here. I guess just move across to died here. It's tricky because this sometimes will block your your jump. Did I search this area's ghost already? I think I did. Okay, let's just go. Oh, we should check. Yeah. 
we're getting beat up. Can we actually leap on top of that? Okay. Oh, nice. Oh, darn it. <laughs> I wanted to see what one of these points look like. Well, oh well, we'll go grab them now anyway. And I'm going that way for another hunter, I guess. Yeah, we need all sorts of protection laws and stuff like that, wouldn't we? Or to stop people from treating the AI poorly. I'm sure some people will just, you know, do whatever with it. They won't care. They'll be like, it's not a human. I can do what I want with it. Alright, right, we need the heal. Oh, we need the healing, but first, we also need the scan. Here, we might as well heal up. I wonder if they'd scan people's brains to get and to get their the way they think. Kind of like in that in the game Soma. This is doing the thing I think it's doing, right? Let me check. Detect hidden soul activation points. Okay. I guess it only detects maybe as well some of the points. Assuming it'll glow if a wall or what have you can be destroyed. Here. Right, well, let's go down. that were in the game Aquaria as well. Oh, sweet. Another regeneration item. So we can equip this and then use my combiner. We get a plus 20. Okay, and then we want these back. Oh, you know, I might have to go back through all the other zones I was in and scan them to make sure I didn't miss any secrets. Oh, wait, 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 Tim. You came down there for a reason. The reason was to look for secret walls. Okay, no, this is just an empty chamber. I guess some rooms are just empty. And that makes sense. I don't know why I'm destroying that. I don't know why I did that. I didn't have to do that. Have I 
been here before? No. Let's look for secret stuff. Nothing. All right, then. So, where are we going, Tim? Well, we have to go this... Oh, but I need to search that way for, for the whatchamacallits. Send me any information, any detail that we could use to identify him. That won't be necessary, boss. I already identified her. Her? Boss, the intruder is Eva-13. One of our agents. Eva-13? Damn, Shattered! That's why you wanted my agent. Shadow, we need our agents back to normal. Fix the biofluid. Yes, boss. Now let's deal with that meddlesome jacker. Yes, boss. Coden, I want you to unencrypt all transmissions from Ava 13 and find out the whereabouts of jacker. Maximum priority. I'm on it, boss. Oh man, that doesn't sound good. Oh wow, they cannot run faster. There's another police station down here. I just want to see what else is in this area. to go. I guess just like the just oh my god. I, I had to stop paying attention to the game. I suppose just like the garden area that there's probably more than eight power sources. We just need to only, we need to get eight. I don't need to kill this thing. There's no reason to do so. Yeah, there's no reason I don't think there's any reason to do so. Oh, that hasn't stopped me before, though. Oh, interesting. It, like, solid solidifies the stuff? I'll stop doing this once I actually find a secret using this form. Nothing. So many of these in this area. Oh, I guess if they need the parts to work on 
whatever this is, the chunker. By the way, I still have not seen what this does. I wonder if... No, because I was killed. I, I didn't say, like, I'll be back or anything like that. Uh-oh. Is there a way for us to get over there? Uh, crap. I'm not brave enough to go... Well, how many... All right. How much energy do I have? Not that much. All right. Let's jump down. This is a bad idea. There is no reason for us to be here, and we will die here. Crap. Uh, well, I... Oh, hold on, Tim. Make that in time, I think. One, two. Oh, we might. We'll have to be really freaking fast to possess that robot down there, or run him all the way over there, up the ladder, and to deactivate the watch my call. I don't think I can make this jump. No, nope, it won't happen. So if I jump from here, I'll only get about this far. Well, I don't have any choice. We're dead. So, I might as well try this. So here we go. Oh, that's right. <laughs> and obviously, I remembered that. Wait a minute. I can just... No, what are you... Why would you walk all the way back there? I have to actually hit the, hit the instantly repossess me button. Perfect. He's just patrolling up here. Really... Oh, come on. You've got to repossess me. Oh, no. oh, man. Wow. So we were supposed to do this after all. Oh, wh holy crap. I can't believe we did it. Where, where this ghost is that damn good. Oh, oh, okay. There is one. There it is. See all the swirly stuff? Okay, now I know what I'm looking for. Cool. Now we can grab all this stuff. Yep. That's all I got. <laughs> Anything else to talk about right at, right at this very moment? Gotta be something something else cool I can talk about with the AI and stuff like that. One extra bullet for that. Extra bullet. So now I know what I'm looking for. I'm looking for swirlies. Any swirlies around? Not that I see. Oh, I should have scanned. Is there anything down here I could have also scanned? I didn't think there was. Oh, there's this. No, nothing. Okay.
Wow, that's a lot of things. All right, then. We're not getting much energy on in this area, and I can farm it in different places. So I'm really just interested in making this easier for us when we come back up here later. Which will be in a few seconds, actually. Oh, if this guy doesn't keep blowing me up. special about those rooms. Maybe in the other mode, those creatures have a good ouch, a good chance to drop something. Oh, I can even scan the room. Come on, I go back. Okay, there was, there was nothing. Ugh, it's twice that one got me. Wow. Yep, can't think of anything else, anyone, I'm so sorry. Oh, uh, what else could I think about? So, I was thinking of, I was talking earlier about how the, we'd have to have a bunch of new laws, right? So, like, this would mean that making a virus, you know, what we're used to for computer viruses, would be the equivalent for AI to be, like, you know, mass murder, I suppose, right? There have to be extra protections for the AIs just to make sure that they can't be killed off that way. Otherwise, it'd be really fragile. Oh, I'm looking at my inventory, and we need one more of them. Okay, so... so we could have gone up? Is that true? Oh, yeah, we could go up here. But we've kind of killed everything off this way, so we're gonna go this way first. We have a cool double jump, so let's do this. Sorry about that. We do not have enough energy for any of this. Core drone damage up. Oh, that's awesome. System shock. When a robot is damaged, all other robots of the same type receive 10% of the damage. A flying drone that will follow you blocking enemy projectiles. Double items left behind by destroyed robots and boxes. Holy crap, some of this stuff is amazing. I'm just gonna grab this because I have the points for it. And why not? We'll grab some healing. Oh man. I want all of those, but that's a lot of alarms to be set off. Let's also check for secrets. Really quick, to see if there's any in this area. I don't see any. Oh wow, it saw me from all the way over there. I guess secret ones must be ones I have to step on or be over. What other walls would there be? They'd be a they'd be another life form, basically, so it's not like you would possess them. Because that would be slavery, right? And that would be wrong. Oh yeah, that would be slavery. So it's not like corporations could actually say this is our copyright at that point. Oh god, almost died. Hey! Awesome, a regeneration 10. So now we can go through. All the steps. Now, 
do I want 320s or do I want the 160s? Let's let's make them better. Come on, let's do it. Yeah, keep keep doing it, Tim. Oh, we don't get an extra use of these ones though. That's interesting. I guess they thought that was too powerful. We're going back over here because I want to check the ladders. Man, this place is massive. All right, let's go downstairs first. That's actually mistaken. Tim. You should see what's over here. Absolutely nothing but that. I guess we'll stop here, everyone. So thank you guys for watching. When we come back, we'll find that last bomb. And then... Well, I'm imagining we're going to be fighting Coder as well in this area. So I guess we'll, we'll see what happens when we find him. So thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next one. Take care.